Hi, welcome to my channel Pharma Tutes. Uh, please subscribe my channel if you are not subscribed yet. And today I am going to explain about Google Classroom. So what it is? It is a classroom uh, which is a new tool in Google Apps for education which is very useful for both teachers and the students. So it you can teachers can create and collect assignments even they can correct assignments and they can give a remarks grades to the assignment even they can take a test and they can correct test papers and they can give marks to test and even uh, they can uh, improve the class communication they can directly make announcements they can ask questions and even students can communicate directly with the teachers and student can submit the assignments online and even they can check the what grade they got for particular test and the assignment so let's see how the google classroom works so first of all you don't need any app for the google classroom you need to have a gmail account and you should sign in to gmail account after signing in you can see at the right corner you can see google apps and you should click that google apps uh, right click and you can see uh, here at the downside you can see the google classroom so you should double click that classroom or if you are not able to get a classroom uh, here what you can do you can just type classroom.google.com so then the classroom will open for you either you can go for google classroom in the apps or you can type classroom.google.com in the google so here already have created the two classrooms so it is showing if you are a new user then it will be a empty then how to create a classroom so for teachers to create a classroom you should go for this plus icon you can see in the right corner you should click on the plus icon and you can see join class and create class so join classes for students so after creating a class teacher will send some code with that student can join so for teacher you should go for you should go for create class and it will ask uh, should sign up for free juice for education just click and continue so it will open um, you can create your own class with the name either you can create like uh, i'm going to create uh, one classroom uh, form g and the section you can give first year or whichever you want to give you can give and subject uh, uh, POC so you can give history maths whatever you want a classroom even you can mention the classroom one two three whatever you want so create so it is very simple to create a classroom just you just enter the whatever the class name uh, and the section and the subject and it will be created so it will take few minutes to create see now your classroom is ready with the form d and you can see the code and you should share this code with the students so that they can join and even you can select the theme you can go for uh, whichever themes you want to select you can go for that so you can select uh, whichever theme you want you, you can select so it's your wish whichever you can select you can choose and you can select classroom so here you got uh, created a classroom and uh, you can communicate directly here uh, you can just type uh, whatever you want to share with the students and even you can add a uh, file from a google drive even you can share a link you can attach a file even you can attach a youtube video to the students and you can post it so just uh, uh, i will just uh, say uh, good morning so whatever you want to share communicate you can communicate with the classroom yeah post and uh, so you can add a comment and next you can go for classroom classwork and here you can see you can create assignments and questions and use topics to organize classwork so that you can easily find on which topic how many assignments has been done so how to do it 
so first we'll see how to create an assignment so just go for create here you can see you can what and all you can do by class work you can give assignment you can ask quiz you can take a question you can you share a material and you can reuse the post which already you have posted and the topic so whichever topic you want to add you can add it so, so first we'll go for assignments so when we open assignments so it will ask the title so let me give a title of unit one and uh, it will ask uh, any instruction you want to go you can give explain in detail so whichever instruction you want to give you can give for the student and you can attach assignments either by google drive or you can share a link file under video or even you can uh, create online so by clicking the plus icon create here you can open the blocks you can open the slides the ppt you can open excel sheets even you can open drawings and forms you can create the assignment online and you can submit you can assign to a student so even by using the assignment you can you can add a question paper suppose if any file you want to add so you can just add uh, by going to your google drive you can just uh, add any question uh, so you can just you can monitor your class students can view file student can edit file and make a copy for each student it is completely with the teachers how to monitor the classroom so and also you can here right sir you can see uh, it is showing the class and also you can assign the questions assignments for all the students or for particular students and even you can give a grade for that suppose if i'm ask giving the grade 30 marks for the assignment particular assignment and even in the same place i can add a question paper also so that uh, we can, I can take a test and you can give a due date so today i'm giving assignment so i can give one day time for them so let i can give the june 4th or even i can mention if i'm taking test i can give one hour time deadline for them to submit the test copies and even you can mention the topic whichever you want to mention so and after this you just you need to assign so this is very simple to give assignments and even to take a test so just to share the question paper now the teacher part is uh, over in giving assignments and so now we'll see how the student uh, uh, will uh, join so even in the people uh, side for the teachers they can invite the co-teachers to teach the particular subject even they can invite through mail or even they can invite through a uh, class code so whichever the student uh, teacher wish either they can invite through mail or they can invite through class code so now we'll see how the student can join how student can view the assignment so now uh, so this is a student uh, so you can see i can uh, how to enter the classroom just by clicking uh, classroom or the google apps in the right corner so it will be open for you so here i have created a farm d class right so here even now uh, you can do uh, you this code you can copy and you can join here by particular code and you can join easily So it will take few moments to join. See already here join. So this is the teacher, uh, sorry, student forum. And you can see uh, it has post posted a new assignment. You can in the streamline, you can see what are the announcement made by the teacher. And in the class work, you can see what is your view work. It is your view work. And it has a deadline also. It is showing June 4th. So view assignment so it will show you the assignment so you can just open the uh, uh, fold uh, file to see the questions 
assignment questions or test questions and student how to reply for this assignment how to upload the assignments so they can just uh, uh, here you can see uh, add or create is there just go for this you can just open docs ppt or excel sheet or drawing or you can type online and you can submit or already you can <coughs> you can uh, write it and you can scan it you can add that file to the google drive and you can uh, go to google drive and you can just uh, attach whichever file you want to attach so this is very simple to submit the assignment for to each students just write it may convert to file and you can you should add it to google drive so you can uh, easily you can see See so easily you can attach your assignment file or test a paper a converting into file. Thing is you should add to Google Drive. And after adding it, you can add a number of files and uh, you can you should do turn in. So if you do turn in, if you press click turn in, then only the teacher can see the assignment. See now you have already submitted. You can unsubmit if you want it. So now we will see for the student uh, uh, teacher forum. See here you can see in the teacher uh, forum. See you can see the uh, unit 1. So 1 has turned in. That means 1 has submitted the assignment. So just click on the, the assignment file. So it will open. In the new window and even it is correction of assignment is very easy here so even you can correct the assignment you can correct assignment see assignment will be open and you can correct it also and you can check and you can give grades for that see it will and you can you can comment so you can add a comment so you can just uh, say good or bad or whatever you need to explain you just comment it and uh, you can check the assignment copy and you can give marks for that suppose I'll give 28 and even you can add a private comment comment you good uh, keep it up so private comment uh, you only student can see and you can post it so one thing after correcting a teacher should return it yes if you return it then only student will be notified and student can check the assignment or test uh, grade so this is how the uh, corrections of assignment is done by using google and even you can see in the here you can see what are your to do list will be there and uh, have so many classes so so many uh, assignments you can see uh, so many students have as assigned means how many students you have assigned and turn in means how many students have submitted and graded you can see in the right corner this shows how many assignments you have corrected and you have returned them then only it will show and after doing this see here in that you can see three icons vertical icons uh, dots you can see and you should mark it as reviewed so this is completed so assignment submitted received corrected and written and then you can see the reviewed assignments in the to do list and also you can see uh, classes which are created whichever classroom you want to go you can go make assignment make uh, announcements create uh, assignments class test you can even you can create quiz you can ask question and in the people section you can see uh, either you what on how number of students are present and even you can invite co-teachers to teach the same subject and in the grade section you can see what are the grade which you are given and what is the average class grade so this is very simple uh, app to use and it is very free uh, please uh, follow it for conducting online assignments online test so if you understood uh, if you have any queries please leave a comment and share 
with the other teachers or who may re may require and thanks for watching the video and please subscribe the channel for more videos